right, so uh, basically this install went really well. Um, it took about 40 minutes. I sped up this video about, you know, 700%. And um, yeah, it went really good. It looks, seems like everything's working. Even my fingerprint reader was working. Uh, that was the thing I was most concerned about. Um, all my audio's working, you know, the microphone's working, keyboard lights are working, Wi-Fi's working. Um, so yeah, I said it took 40, uh, 40 minutes, and that's on an SSD, so I can't promise that for everybody. I've got a really fast internet connection as well. Um, so yeah, I mean, your usage may vary, but everything went well. Um, all of my programs worked. Um, I did it on my laptop first. Um, I wanted to do it. I wanted to do it on my tablet first, um, um, but I wanted to do it on the laptop because all of my programs are on there, and I wanted to see if everything would work. I was even surprised. Power DVD never works um, during an upgrade, but it even that even worked. So I was excited about that. Um, even my old Adobe Premiere works. Uh, all of my Adobe programs worked. Um, I did not try my printer. So I will definitely have to give that a, a try and maybe I'll put it in the description or something like that. Um, that's obviously a big deal. If my printer doesn't work, then I definitely won't be upgrading on my desktop anytime soon. But yeah, um, it was a good process, maybe the best ever for upgrading your Windows inst installation. Um, but yeah, we'll continue to see. I haven't gamed on it yet. Um, I'll try to do that a little bit later. See how the games work. Steam works pretty good. Um, but yeah, so yeah, it went well went quickly. I, I like it. Um, Cortana's not quite as cool as I thought she would be. Um, she's definitely better than the little uh, paperclip dude from uh, Windows 2000, if you remember that. Um, but yeah, yeah, I like the new OS. Um, honestly, I kind of like the old start screen, but the start menu is cool too, so you know, I'll take that. Um, you know, I think this operating system definitely is not copying Mac OS. Um, I think it's kind of doing its own thing. And I think it's definitely, at least aesthetically, an upgrade over Windows 8. Um, but yeah, I'm going to keep using the laptop. Time will tell. And uh, yeah, maybe I'll make some more follow up videos about that. So keep watching the video. Um, I'll go through a few things running some programs, kind of checking things out. Um, but yeah, you know, as of now, I could say it's worth an upgrade. Um, not having to pay for it is cool too. Now I only paid about 30 bucks for Windows 8 Pro. I did like a student discount thing. Um, so I appreciate Microsoft coming up off the price, but I know they're trying to do the whole subscription thing as you can tell I don't like subscriptions I'm still winning using uh, Adobe Premiere Pro 4 CS4 from like way way back in the day so if I can avoid you know buying more software I'm still using like Microsoft Office 2007 now I got 2013 for free for a year but I can guarantee you, after that year is up, I'm not going to be renewing. I'll be back on 2007. So, yeah, beyond that, um, you know, with me, as long as that core stuff is working, I still need to test that printer. As long as the core stuff is working, I'm cool, you know, but it's just going to take me a while to upgrade my desktop I just don't trust anything it's just too important 
so uh oh yeah also you you may have noticed the little black dots all over the screen all that's doing is covering up stuff i don't want you to see i like to keep my uh secret identity and actually secret you know so yeah um leave a comment below the video has a few more minutes left so yeah, if you want me to make a follow-up video about anything specific, you know, let me know. Well, all right, I hope this video helped. And um, yeah, you know, leave your comments, sub, give me a shout out, share the video, please. Like it, and you know, please help my self-esteem. Um, I do this for the fun, I don't do it for the money. So yeah, let me know how I can get better at this video thing. Well, all right, so that's the install. Like I said, it took 40 minutes from clicking the button to being complete. So this is just a few things that I wanted to check on. But all right, peace out.